Hello my green fans and welcome back. Today in episode 9 we are not going too far from the last one and that is why I decided to start with just adding a bit more details to Remetinet's roundabout. And after that we will start with today's topic and that is adding embankment on both sides and placing first buildings on the left side of the river. And if you want to see how this episode turns out then stay till the end of the episode and cinematics. So welcome back, episode 8 for me was a smashing hit and I was so blown away with how much views it got in very short amount of time. And not to mention that the channel has again had a bit more growth, so let's give a warm welcome to all the new subscribers. As I said earlier I went back a bit to Remetinet's roundabout and added some more details I missed like some more plants on some spots and I added probe traffic lights as that was the one of the comments how they are missing here. I honestly forgot to mention that in the previous episode. And why I didn't add them is that I have known they would be hard to set up. I tried but the issue I had was that for some reason I could not separate some phases for some parts of the roads. On the approaching roads to roundabout there is either 4 or on some 3 lanes among some that are protected lanes, only for the first most right and exit. It would not make sense to see cars stopping at the entrances on that spot as in real life they can enter and exit without stopping. And until I find a way to make them work properly they will stay just as props for looks. But let's talk about stuff I'm building right now. For me one of the important parts I needed to build was embankment on river Sava. And unlike many other European cities, Zagreb has still not come all the way to the river edge. The best examples for me are maybe Paris, London and Rome, that fully integrated their rivers and city is just on the edge. For me, in some way, I like that we have this green strip as embankment is very popular place for people who love sports and outdoor recreation. It is especially good for running. And on the game side of things, I was thinking already for some time how to make the embankment. And I came to conclusion that the best way is to lay down the gravel road and bring it to the final height. After that I was adding terraforming networks on both sides as there is a bit of flat land before the river edge. And I added several so I could make nicer edge on one side. And to finish it I added network slopes as that way it looks more man-made. For this episode I have a story from history about River Sava and its relationship with Zagreb. On 25th October 1964 a devastating flood happened in Zagreb. It was caused by high rainfall upriver. And even though this was a known fact from as early as the Roman times that some areas are more susceptible to flooding, industrialization caused the city to expand in these areas. The damage to the city was extensive but it sparked a large urban redevelopment and in turn led to creation of several new planned neighborhoods. And several months later an overhaul of embankment started. Embankments have been made taller than before on 27 km stretch and in that area they have been built 300 meters apart where the river was placed in roughly 100 meter wide channel flanked by detention fields of similar width. This was the worst flood but also the last major one after which city dealt with the dangers posed by the river Sava. And if you want to know and learn more about the flood and extents of it, I will as usually put the link to Wikipedia page in the description down below, with the whole story and even some pictures from that time. 
The story is really long, it wouldn't fit in one episode. And for the large part of this episode, the inspiration was this place you can see on the screen now. It is a small developed area with two large shops and McDonald's. I did try to hold true to the general shape of this area, but also I added some of my personal touches. I can even say that at some points I made some things even nicer than real life. Although I am a bit sad that Google is ignoring Zagreb as they still haven't updated Remetinet's roundabout area and here you can actually see how it used to look before. You could also see some of the areas surrounding it in the distance that I'm actually looking forward of building in some of the next episodes. One thing I maybe went a bit overboard was nature detailing, but I just love placing all sorts of grasses, trees and bushes. I especially love how it's easy to achieve more natural look by just playing with the scale of the plants, which is one of the things I really would like to see more people utilize. And now that I'm watching editing and recording the voiceover, this was also a detail I really enjoyed making. I am so happy we have all sorts of additional assets to create so many cool things. And now, because I really don't know what to ramble about at this point, I will let you watch and enjoy the music for a bit. I am not sure why I like it so much, but somehow building this card storage place was so oddly satisfying and even though I had built one way before, I couldn't just copy paste it, but I had to build new one from scratch. Not that copy paste isn't a good idea in some situation, especially if you want to keep the consistency of the project.
And that is all for today, I do hope you enjoyed the episode. Today in Cinematics we have a song sang by Jimmy Stanich called Noću kraj Sava, in English At Night by Sava. I do hope you will also like it as much as I did first time I heard it. And of course I want to give a warm welcome to all the new subscribers once more and all the support it means a lot to me. And of course I appreciate all the comments and likes, so feel free to write something in the comment section down below, even a simple hello. And if you are new here and you like what you've seen today and you want to see more, also you can subscribe and ring a bell to get notified about my new content, it's free. Until the next video, stay safe and healthy. Za tobom plaću naše vrbe stare, za tebe pita mene svaki val. Za tobom tuži glas moje gitare, kad podno vrbe sjednem sam uz žal. Tu gdje me svaki predmet na te sjeća, tu gdje o tebi šapće svaki glas. Tu gdje ugasnu čak i naša sreća, ja volim prove svaki tužni čas, noć u kraj save. Kad mjesečina sija, do zore plave, na tebe mislim ja, noć u nas avi, kad gledam zvijezda roj. Sanjam na javi Da sam nekoć bio tvoj Tu gdje me svaki predmet na te sjeća tu gdje o tebi šapće svaki glas Tu gdje ugasnu čak i naša sreća Ja volim provest svaki tužni čas Noću kraj save Kad mjeseći nas ja Do zore plave Na tebe mislim ja Noću nas avi kad gledam svije 
Za tobom plaću naše vrbe stare, za tebe pita mene svaki val. Za tobom tuži glas moje gitare, kad podno vrbe sjednem sam uz žal. Tu gdje me svaki predmet na te sjeća, tu gdje o tebi šapće svaki glas. Tu gdje ugasnu čak i naša sreća, ja volim provest svaki tužni čas, noću kraj save, kad mjesečina sija, do zore plave, na tebe mislim ja, noću na savi, kad gledam zvijezda roj, Sanjam na javi, da sam nekoć bio tvoj. Tu gdje me svaki predmet na te sjeća, tu gdje o tebi šapće svaki glas Tu gdje ugasnu čak i naša sreća Ja volim provest svaki tužni čas Noću kraj save Kad mjeseći nas ja Do zore plave Na tebe mislim ja Noću na savi kad gledam zvijezda roj, sanjam na javi, da sam nekoć bio tvoj, da sam nekoć bio tvoj, da sam nekoć bio tvoj. Za tobom plaću naše vrbe stare, za tebe pita mene svaki val. Za tobom tuži glas moje gitare, kad podno vrbe sjednem sam uz žal. Tu gdje me svaki predmet na te sjeća, tu gdje o tebi šapće svaki glas. Tu gdje ugasnu čak i naša sreća, ja volim provest svaki tužni čas, noću kraj save, kad mjeseći nas ja, do zore plave, na tebe mislim ja, noću na savi, kad gledam zvijezda roj, Sanjam na javi, da sam nekoć bio tvoj. Tu gdje me svaki predmet na te sjeća, tu gdje o tebi šapće svaki glas, tu gdje ugasnu čak i naša sreća, ja volim provest svaki tužni čas, noću kraj save, kad mjesečina zija do zove.